we're going to get into the old main building, which is the former Utica State Hospital, the former Utica Lunatic Asylum. And this is a rare occasion. We've been working with the Mohawk Valley Psychiatric Center. They, they've been very good to allow us to go inside. They're basically running the show, but the Landmark Society is going to help docent it. The Landmark Society was influential, actually, actually very instrumental in saving the building back when it first closed in 1978. And this building had been around since um, 1843, so it's well over 150 years old. Uh, we are very concerned about the building. It's, it's very historic. It's a national historic landmark. Um, actually, we, it was for a while, it was for sale, and uh, we, we got the state to kind of take it back, and right now it's being used for uh, medical record storage. But they're very good about allowing us inside and letting us see you know, what's inside. Uh, back around 2002, they did some renovation work in there, so the first floor has been renovated, and uh, they put some new lighting in heating system and some did a lot of painting and all that, so it's, it's actually quite nice in there. We're only going into the first floor. We can't get into the basement. We can't get into the upper floors. And it's free and open to the public. It's going to be um, rain or shine, and it's a multiple set of tours. So basically you come in whenever you get there and you get in line, and you know, you're going to wait in line and get up to the door, and you'll spend about maybe 20 or so, maybe 25 minutes inside the building. And it will be docented. It will be basically you go through various stations and see things. There's a lot of pictures in there now. I was just in there this morning. Um, a lot of pictures, and uh, there's a lot of story, uh, backstory, and history, and all that good stuff. So it's going to be a very, very interesting time. It's going to be very crowded, I imagine, because a lot of people are very interested in seeing this building, and it's not open that often. And Michael, this was done. Was it four or five years ago, back during the old Utica Monday Night series? Yes, I believe the last one was around 2009, 2010, somewhere in that range, but about four or five years ago, yeah. And uh, you mentioned that it is a, a free event, but uh, the Landmark Society is asking for a $5 donation, and I know that goes towards your work at uh, Rutger Park. Yeah, we're suggesting that if people would like to donate, uh, you know, we'd like to uh, ask for, for $5 if they'd be willing to give it or, or whatever they'd like to give. Um, you know, it is free, you know, to the public, obviously, but... We're going to use any proceeds that we do get to help in the restoration efforts that we have ongoing at number one and number three Rector Park in Utica. Now, I mentioned that Old Main is a National Historic Landmark, which is a very high designation. There's only two in Utica. The other one is number three Rector Park, the Miller Conkling Kernan House. So those are very important designations as far as historic preservation and historic you know, uh, landmarks go. So we're very interested in doing what we can to preserve and restore those buildings. Mike, we will see you up Monday night at Old Main, and I appreciate the time. Absolutely. My pleasure, Eric.